Hello everybody, this is Grazo. Welcome back to A Game of Thrones in Crusader Kings. This will probably be the last episode for this character. Uh, he is on death's doorstep. Um, so we're going to die within a year. Um, so I'm curious what we can do, what, what we can achieve here with Lord Joran, the Brute of the Iron Island, 74 years old. Just so you know, this guy has killed 36 characters. He's been a fun character to play. He's the first king uh, of our custom dynasty here uh, as House Kane. Our next character is going to be his son, Lord Calico. Um, there's a couple of wars that I could p probably fight if I, if I get out of debt. Um, so I think we'll go that route and probably raise some soldiers as raiders. Um, we need to go into the Wildling territory with our 22,000 soldiers and take as much gold as physically possible. So let's just see. Potentially, like, West Shelf, 2,000 people, 900, 6,000. So down here is we're going to need a lot of uh, soldiers to fight these guys. But they do have some money, so I might suggest we raise our, our, all of our soldiers as raiders. Get to, let's get a new rally point here. And raise all as raiders. That'll take a while to load up. Uh, for anybody new, welcome to the series. This is quite a small channel. About 600 subs, give or take, as we speak right now. And um, my goal is to get to 1,000. So if you're watching this and you like Game of Thrones and Crusader Kings content, uh, maybe consider subscribing. Uh, there's a lot more episodes coming. We just had a daughter. My daughter has given birth to a daughter. Uh, Maeva. Sona is a nicer name. Let's go with that. Captain has arrived. I have been trying to just spend my prestige um, before a character dies. We can't reform the culture. I don't think he's going to last that long. Um, we recently changed it. We have to wait until 4.11 to change that. So we, we have three different raiding parties here. So we could cover, honestly, a lot of ground. So why don't we send these guys... Where's their capital? They, they have 6,000 soldiers. What are they? They're actually pretty pretty strong. So let's combine two armies. Let's get two guys over here. And then the other one... We'll actually begin to send up the west coast. We want a reaver, which is me. Let's uh, I'll lead it myself. Zero. There's 13 up here. And that one has 590 soldiers. Let's land here first. Good web. We're going to go to good web first with our remaining branch over here. That's a really bad route to take, or route to take. Let's go here instead. Get some, get 19 gold pretty easily there. And we can unpause. Uh, we are murdering people in the background. We're murder murdering uh, House Broom, which is in um, in our rivals. So that's why that person pulled the short straw and is going to die pretty soon. Um, but I want to make my way up here, I think. Maybe, maybe we actually go here first just to get some immediate gold okay we have taken that one really quickly we can go here next railing along the coast doesn't give you attrition which is really nice and we have 14,000 soldiers just because they have more soldiers in this area so we decided to split them a little bit uh, hopefully this gets rid of our rival um, We want to continue murdering her, I think. So let's let's get a new plan. That is... There's nothing there. 13 loot there. We'll go there next. Prisoner taken too. We will ransom these for money, I think. All the time money. She has a claim on Grey Tuft. Uh, that's only for a hook. Uh, Berserker. And 18 prowess. Can I... The magic aversion and... Like, you're not a bad character. Maybe I'll recruit you. Sure. We got Snowcat snow in our court. This guy's is going to die anyway. Are you worth any money? You're only a, worth a hook. Let's get some um, piety. Bring me bounteous plunder. Bring me bounteous plunder all the time. Uh, we could come along here next. They haven't raised any soldiers against us. What was that task finished? Bestow royal favor. Okay. 
Didn't even know I was doing that. Let's work on domestic affairs just to get some uh, opinion up. And I mean, there's lots of money up here. Let's go here next. How many soldiers? 14 casualties. 14. 14 is not bad, is it? Got some good uh, suggestions for kind of taking areas of the map. The neck was, was, was uh, suggested in the comments. Thank you for that. Uh, I think my next war will be Winterfell, though. Uh, we got a new artifact, and I will likely just break that down for gold immediately. We don't need the prestige. It's fine. Prisoner taken. Let's have a look. Are you worth any money? 37 gold. Beautiful. Let's take that. Meanwhile, we can continue on. I think we have finished raiding there. We can go here next. So we're losing about seven a month, so we need to, uh, we need to take lots of prisoners. Might even go into Wintermouth here next, if there's some cash. Zero. Places along the coast tend to get targeted first, which makes sense. You should be taking that one next. That's great. Now you can come here for 17 and then over there. I don't want to go over there for one. That doesn't seem like a good idea. Seven prisoners. What we want to do here is just mass ransom. See how much cash we get out of that. What's this? Pay ransom. Yep. Yep. Get some gold. That's what we're here for. Uh, meanwhile, what about this place here? 16 up here? Let's go there. Let's be aware that when we're when we are kind of taking these pieces of land, we are losing soldiers, right? And our soldiers are expensive, so it's kind of counterproductive. Um, there's people. Yeah, you're worth money. You're worth money. Oh, I shouldn't have done that one for a hook. Any good characters while we're here? I learned someone's non-believer secret. That's fine. Uh, good characters. Let's have the flying fox. <laughs> he's a good learner. Uh, he's forty-nine. Let's just pause for a second. Demand your conversion. Yeah, I suppose just demand your conversion. Let you go. Let's convert all these people to Ironborn culture, uh, Ironborn religion. I was gonna say this guy looks like a fighter, but he's actually not a not a good fighter. Magic conversion, let you go. Sweet. How many, how much gold have we got? So we have 95 here and we have 63 there, which is good. We will continue ravaging the lands north of the wall. Whoa! Okay, pause, 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 pause. We did die, so that was expected. <laughs> And we're going to play as Lord Calico. Calico was the first name of our character in this series, if you remember that. Um, we're about, I think, 13, 14 episodes in so far. Lord Joran of the Iron Island Soul has finally been cast into the cloudy hall of the Storm God at 74 years of age. He died of old age. Although quite famous for his sharp intellect, he could not outsmart the Drown God. Lord Calico ascends to the throne of formidable duelist. May many expect him to excel in tournaments and personal combat alike. Beautiful. Okay, so before we progress anywhere, let's just uh, get this guy looking sharp, shall we? Uh, look how small he is. Um, I would like his beard to be like a bit more cooler than this. Big bushy beard. Um, I think his hair color, right? Let's just let's just talk about this for a second. Maybe it's a little bit whiter. A little bit dirtier. Okay, cool. Now, beard. And I don't want the cloak. Or that cloak, anyway. You do an adventurous cloak. I do like the fur cape. This one. <laughs> King's card. Um, one that doesn't interfere with his beard so much would be beautiful. Well, cloak. And 
his pants. Like where? Okay. Here he is. Beautiful. Um I think we want this instead. Prestige. Boar Tusk. That instead of that. Let's get rid of this. Put the Boar Tusk in. Uh, masterwork. Sure. Let's throw that in. Um, Renown Romance Game Power. Bye bye. Yeah. Everything's equipped. So for this character, we need to get a, a new council. Um, wonder if this will impact. This guy's actually really good at diplomacy. Let's get him in there. Spy master, we'll need a good one. Uh, my brother, or Theon, get him in there. And a good steward. This guy's a vassal. Let's get him there. I am way above my domain limit. I can hold three things currently. And this is pushing me down learning. Um, yeah, I suppose let's go down learning. We already have whole of body. Maybe we don't go down learning then. He's a fighter, right? So I think I want to go martial with this person. Hmm. Control growth. Let's go down martial with this guy. He already has whole of body, which I think is great. Um, and we're at, we're out of debt, I suppose. I think it would be good, good a good idea to return with our raiders now, unless they're currently going to another place to raid. After that, then they can come home. Um, too few concubines. Let's get an old one so we don't have lots of kids. What is succession looking like currently? We're gonna play as Alester of the Ar Iron Islands. Alister. Alester. Um, right, so he's my son and player heir. Who am I married to? Married to a regular lady who is beautiful. Um, did my son get the trait? Lord Harold. I have a couple of kids. Any of them beautiful. You're getting comely. Okay, I think I want to get a new wife. I want to divorce this lady. And we can marry her to, sure, marry this guy instead. Uh, just to keep her around, I want somebody that's good at stewardship, just so we can hold more land. Um, 20, 25 is good. 22, she's only 20 years old. She's a lowborn. I'll take a hit for this, but uh, it's worth it. Just for the stewardship, I think. Let's get a new wife. Perfect. Now, what we can do when she has joined my court, we can stick her on assist ruler for stewardship, and we can hold another domain. So now we only need to give away two properties or two uh, areas where we, we don't want to hold anymore. And uh, Bearstone is somewhere we're, we're actually going to grant to... Hmm. Dynasty Kane. Someone that's not landed. My nephew. Uh, stewardship. Let's give it to Donald Kane here. There we go. And... Just looking at development. Ironhold, where's Ironhold? This little small little area is giving us some nice levies. Lord's Board is not giving me much currently. Many at uh, 26,000. I'm going to give away Ironhold. Grant to my nephew. Okay, now we're back to our regular domain limit. Let me get a new marshal here. Let's get 
my sister in there and we'll get somebody that's good at stewardship here so we have a, a pretty strong council which is nice um and because we're doing a martial focus i think we'll get more more men this person does not like me minus 53 She's a claimant. Oh, okay. She's also a powerful vassal. I want to keep her happy. Let's give her a gift. And she's not good enough to be on the council. Um, Pike, Saltcliff, and Lonely Light. I think we'll give away Saltcliff. Granted to my son and player heir. Where's Saltcliff? Saltcliff. We give him Lord's Board. Oh, touchy titles is what I'm looking for. Um, grant to opinion of me. Hmm. Yeah, Salt Cliff. Grant to. Opinion of me. Um, Dynasty. Kane. Give it to this guy. My best friend. Let's give it to this guy. Why can I not grant him that title? It's interesting. Grant to Ah, okay. That's how we do it. So I'll give it to my best friend here, Salt Cliff. Okay. I think I still need to give away one more. I want to keep Pike and give away Lonely Light. Where we well, it's where we started. Yeah, we give away Lonely Light. Grant it to Kane. And I'll give it to my son. You know, that gets rid of that. Uh, I can declare wars, I can negotiate alliances. We'll take all the alliances that we can get in here. Looks like she'll now accept. Perfect. Perfect. And yeah, we'll take an alliance with you. Okay, have we returned home with our soldiers? Sorry, just looking after succession so far. Where are our soldiers? Looks like they're they're gonna there's gonna be a fight up here. Who was this? They're also a hostile army, that's fine. Can get out of there before they land on us. Are they coming up here for a fight? I think I was leading this army myself, so I might need to replace. Yeah, I need a new commander. Let's get this guy in there. Need a need a worthy successor. Needs a worthy successor. Sorry, this one. None none of these people are serving as knights. Andrik, my half brother, twenty one prowess. I have really good fighters, which is beautiful. Where's Andrik? Force. And we can add him uh, here now. I think. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Raid loot delivered. 95. Beautiful. We are losing a ton of money. Why are we losing so much money? Court amenities. Okay, make your way back. You can disband this army. And... That was really quick. Disband all. Sweet. Now, let's just have a look. How are we losing so much lieges, taxes? Oh, I should be able to declare. Hang on a second. Orange Tron. Modify vassal contract. Oh, demand council position. I want to be your steward just so I get cash. 
that gives me just a little bit more income. Yeah, 20 a month is insane. Maybe we change the court amenities. Court grandeur. Like, we're only meant to be here. Um, let's, let's, let's pull this back a little bit. Like... Now we should be a little bit better. Boar Tusk is low durability. Um, okay. Can I repair that? Um, Ulras. He's not really good, is he? <laughs> I don't want to lose cash. Intrigue plus one. Yeah, I suppose. Someone's a non-believer, that's fine. Order will be restored. 170 gold. Ugh. Someone's levies will go up. Let's take the levies. Okay. And... Okay, we had a little bit of succession. We are making positive money now. Um, so we just got to wait. By their time, what claims have we got? Gain 50 marshal. Levies. Take the extra levies. Powerful vassals. Let's have a look at these guys. So you're not great. You are also not great. You're also not great. You're also not great. Okay, cool. Uh, how are factions? Two new court artifacts, really. What's new? Acquisition date. Just banners. Ironborn Tapestry. I can't break any of these. Could destroy the Greyjoy throne. Um, Mercenary Horrorcross. Okay. It was just like getting me to look at them. Didn't really do much. Okay, we got some gold off this guy. Um, I might disallow homage in a little bit of time, but let's just see what claims have we got. Like, where can I go to war? I have to get out of debt first. We'll get out of debt first, it seems. I'm invited to someone's hunt. I don't want to go to that just yet. He does not serve as a captain. Andrik, why not? Oh, I've clicked on that one so many times in the wrong, <laughs> the wrong position. Um, maybe we'll get this 18 person to serve. Of course. Of course. Can we now select this? Okay, that's just really annoying. Sorry about that. Okay, we're going to speed up time a little bit. I've had a child. Uh, my captain's giving birth to a daughter, Rhonda Cain. Okay, someone can marry. That's a good marriage. Dangerous faction. Wants lower crown authority. Um, powerful vassal here, 3,000 men. Range of marriage with, doesn't have any daughters. Want to marry my granddaughter? No, that's not going to work. Um, you have 2,000. That's arranged marriage with 
essentially my granddaughter here. My granddaughter, by the way, is a Greyjoy. How that happened, I don't know. Daughter, arranged marriage. Want to marry nephew, maybe? They'll be born at the house cane. Let's just see if this works. Will she leave now? No. Let's hopefully get her out of that. Uh, out of there. So this one's 3,000 soldiers. 3,000. 2,000. Yeah, that's a big battle. I need to get rid of this faction. Um... My half brother's a genius, and a daughter will be married into House Kane. Let's see if this works. Okay, lines formed. Should pull out, pull them out of the the pact. Keep that trait that you have there. That's fine. What about this guy? Maybe, maybe you want to marry someone as well. Your son, maybe? Yeah, let's marry this guy. Arrange marriage to my granddaughter. You want I want matrilineal. Get another Greyjoy, sure. Royal visit, that's fine. Just want to see that faction again. We need to pay people off. They can't send it now, right? So I think I'm good. And maybe over time our counselor will work on opinion. I want you to increase control. Here. And you are working on converting the faith in more months. That's fine. I want you to work on taxes. I've had a daughter, and they're going to call it Mera, Mera Kane. Uh, I don't think I can go to war yet. Not right now, anyway. Let's do this betrothal. Valerians, moving, uh, marrying a Valerian. Great. Odd by beauty. What does this do? Under the soldier pine, in the scorching midday heat, they sit in the in the shadow under the great stone pine, playing on lutes and flutes. They sing. Okay, I've had enough of that story already. Uh, stress. I can lose money. Don't want to do that. Great pine gets chopped down. Yeah, I'm gonna take this. Cut down the tree. Get some cash. Sweet. Almost out of debt. Uh, cultural fascination. I'm ahead of the culture. I am. Let's just see what we want to work on. Banking will give us development growth. Maybe we don't want to work on banking right now. Potentially. Sappers is a good one, right? Um... Pin at arms. 19 years. Hmm. I do like this. It gives us more men at arms. Let's do this one instead. More soldiers. Sweet. Okay, so we are out of debt. We can go to war. Oh, we don't. We, we we have zero claims on anything. Oh, we lost that claim on Winterfell. That's right. Okay. Well, maybe this character is the person that builds up our realm rather than actually goes to war. We're going to take this playthrough slow. Steady wins the race. Um, How are we for time? Let me just check here. Okay. Uh, We might need to wrap this up pretty soon. <clears throat> Let's hold court maybe before we do that. Civic rivalry. 
Master Will, who's been clearly who has clearly been working himself up to something, greets me. My lord, the dogs of Prodox think they're better than us. Prodox is the nicer town. Sweet. Um He gets protected. So who is this? Your Lord Yall. Yep, I'll take more levies and you can keep your title. That works. Um this guy to become my bodyguard. Interesting. What's actually this guy? He's way better. Yeah, sure. Take him as my bodyguard. Nice. Uh, folks, that's where we're going to wrap it up for today. Thank you so very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Uh, we'll do Royal Visit here. Uh, look forward to seeing you in the next one. If you haven't subscribed, do check already. About 80% of my viewers are not subscribed to my channel, which is mind-boggling. Uh, but somehow you're finding my videos, which I appreciate. Um, I think for me... What I'd like to do is get a claim and go to war with this new character. But I also want to build up the area that we live in. Um, work on getting better buildings, work on getting better income, and ultimately then a stronger army. So I will do some thinking, but this is the, the new realm, new reign of uh, Lord Calico of the Ar Iron Islands. He's 42. He'll live for a little bit of time because he has hold of body, and we're going down Marshall. Uh, see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching as always. Do we leave your thoughts, comments, and feedback below? I look forward to reading them. And as always, enjoy the rest of your day. Take care. Bye-bye.